Did you know that in Thrive Architect you can create gradients like this? Or like this? A bit more subtle, like this? Or even combine pictures with gradients just like this? And that because the Thrive Editor is used in all of our products, this means that you can use gradients on your lead generation forms or even on the top section of your blog templates. Now, let me show you how all of that is done. Now, you will be able to use everything that I explain with this gradients when you have the Thrive Editor. So here, I'll select a background section, but you will see that you can use this on many more elements and that it's not only when you're in Thrive Architect, but also when you're in Thrive Leads, when you're in Thrive Apprentice and any of the other plugins. So the moment that you select an element on the page, you can go into the background style and from here, you can see that you have an option to add a gradient. Click on this and you will get a linear black to white gradient. To change the colors, simply click on this first indicator and then choose your first color and then click on the second indicator and then choose your second colors. That is how easy it is to make a two color gradient. And then you can use this drag and drop here to change the angle of your gradient and to create really, really cool effects. But of course, you can have more than two colors in your gradient, such as the one that I showed you before, this one, for example. When you click on this, you can see that this is a three color gradient. So we start with the color turquoise and then we have our yellow orange color and then we have this pinkish color. Now, the way to do this is by simply clicking anywhere in this colored bar so that you can add a new marker in here. So let's go back to our two color gradient so that I can show you. From here, let's open this and then we can click anywhere we want our third color to be and then we can select our third color. So now we have a gradient that will go from orange to turquoise and then from turquoise to pink. And you can use this slider to make it more or less go from to one side. So this is the percentage of your colors. Now, what's really cool with this is that you can also use this to add transparency in a gradient. So let's imagine that instead of using green, we want to go to transparent. So now our background is going from orange to transparent and then from transparent back to pink. And that is exactly what we used here on this image in order to cover part of the image, but not the other half. So when you click on this, you can see that there's a linear gradient and that the linear gradient goes from purple and then to transparent. And in order to make sure that half of the image was staying visible, we used this slider to change where the transparency started. So as you can see, this makes it more or less transparent. This is a very easy way to add cool effects to your background sections, to your pictures and so on. And all of that without using Photoshop, only using the Thrive Editor. Now, if you want to have this layered effect, simply click on your background section and then choose one of the other layers to add. So here, for example, we're going to add an image layer. Choose one of our images. And now we have our gradient underneath our image, so we can't actually see it. So we can drag this gradient on top of our image. How cool is that? And because we use this transparency in our gradient, we can still see the image that's underneath it. Now, I hope that this short tutorial showed you how you can use gradients on your website and how you can create really, really cool visual effects with these gradient layers. Now, if you have any questions, don't hesitate, leave them in the comments below. And of course, if you are an online entrepreneur, don't hesitate to click that subscribe button, hit the bell, because then you will be notified when we publish new videos.